Monkey, no matter how many times you reincarnate, you're still blind to the ways of this world. Now, in your folly, you've hindered the dealings of the court. But above that, you've given a girl who knows no limits a false hope. <laughs> I shall transform her into a mighty golden pill and uh, keep it safe for you. Think about her, won't you? Should you feel like stirring trouble in your next life?
must save me. Uh, uh, so, both my trap and my vessel failed. But how? When I saw him, I... I just couldn't. The destined one then arrived and bested me. Now the monkey has ransacked our hollow. A mere monkey showing such disrespect. Your wound was recovering. But now it's getting worse. Fear not. I'll deal with him. But before that, that thing of mine, do you still have it? I, I do. Very well. Despite all your failures, you led the destined one here. I should reward you for that. But the thing I gave you, now I must have it.
changed a bit. You fool. Ay, 
you have grown in strength, but not in wisdom. You've not only hurt Bajia and his darling, but also laid waste to the seal of the High Ones. A grave misdeed. Mortal or immortal, all seek to break from the past and start anew. Yet destiny, like a lover's tongue, speaks one way and means another. Though you may savor it yourself, you can never tell if you truly want it or not. Long ago, the many-legged one was subdued by Bodhisattva Pilanpur and locked on Purple Cloud Mountain. Only by a plea from the Celestial Court was he spared. The Immortals dispatch minions to enact their will, while they remain serene as if playing a game of chess. Pity those pawns. They know full well what they are, yet they cling to false hopes and even take pride in it. The posts of the court have stood unchanged, but the same seat might not always be held by the same immortal. So too the seven spider guise, they boast an endless procession of generations. Ah, even the sacred Gormond remains mundane if he clings to the ties of love. He was an admiral of the court. A pig in the mountains, and Bajia in the journey. Yet his nature remains unchanged. <laughs> so be it, a guileless fool may know less sorrow. This one must be a high immortal from the court. Amid the trials of the Seven Spiders and the Many-Eyed One, it was Bodhisattva Pilanpur who lent a hand. No aid from the court was given. But <laughs> Wukong is ever heedless of rules. He might have sought higher places for help. <laughs> 